Dear God, we thank you for this day, for Jesus, and for each other. Open our hearts to walk ever closer to you and to serve others in your name. Amen. Amen. Good morning. I'm Ruth Foss, for those of you who do not know me. And I'm on the Consecration Committee for our church. At Reverend Susan's request, I had prepared some comments on stewardship giving. As I was reviewing them late yesterday, not with much satisfaction, my dad flashed across my mind like Dickens' ghost of the Christmas past. <laughs> my dad was a businessman, always on church's finance committee and fundraising committees. Not a man of many words, he would have said to me about my comments, be brief, tell them what you want, and sit down. <laughs> I think he'd then instruct me to understand and to relate to you. One, they are the church in this place. Tell them what you need and want and how they can accomplish it. They are God's people. They will do it. So, here are my thoughts, almost in what he would call a bullet point form, about our stewardship. We are God's beloved. He died for us, redeems us, and gives us eternal life. His Holy Spirit is constantly with us and in us. God wants relationship with each of us individually. God wants us to do the same for others as he did. Tell all about his love and actions and words. To minister and care for his people, we need resources. That comes from your conviction, your heart, and your giving. St. Christopher's founders, when setting up the parish and church, stipulated that 10% off the top of all monies received goes to outreach before anything else is done. This is our heritage and is still true today. We all at St. Christopher's are blessed with resources to accomplish great things for God. Talk to him, your father, in prayer. Give him time with you. See how you, with his guidance, can stretch your commitment and giving for his mission. Finally, with prayer and thanksgiving, complete your estimate of giving card, return it to the church on Consecration Sunday, and then celebrate and party with your co-workers in God's kingdom. See, it's really easy peasy. You are already growing in and with God, building his kingdom. Thank you. Amen. Amen. Amen.